congratulations to the reigning Dope Block champion, Crafty, on an amazing oh, performance. Oh, yeah. 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 We're moving on. Yes, and we're doing a format of the, I don't know if this format in Battle Rap Full Stop has been done, but I'm going to say it's definitely never been done, uh, done in Dope Flop. I'm really excited for this one. Let's get into it. We have one written round unlimited as long as they want, and then we're doing a back to back freestyle round as round two. This is going to be dope. MC. On my left hand side, my guy, a serious talent in UK music. We got Sue out of Kinch, make some noise. Yeah. 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 On the right hand side, a guy who's been putting in that work for Don't Flop, yeah? I love a league, yeah? We got Canel. Let's go! Canel, uh, Canel won the flip and chose to go first. It's round one of two on Canel. Let's go, bro. In 2006 alone, you released 78 different verses with the word Sarah Ballam in. <laughs> Hopeless, mate. I don't believe Sarah Ballam's a real word. I think it's just some made up bollocks that boom bap open mic old heads say. And I'm not the biggest fan of modern jazz music. <laughs> I'll go so far as to say that I'm a hater. It's all technique and lacking flavour. So imagine my reaction when I heard that I'm clashing. Oxford University's most prolific Gareth Gates collaborator. <laughs> you're only known for your freeze, but you're not on the ball them. Face the same opponents as me, you'd be washed up by all of them. I've battled middle class white guys. You're posher than all of them. I battled, Let's go. I battled some chicks too. You got bigger knockers than all of them. <laughs> I will definitely bottle Trevor McDonald. <laughs> And the grey beard, grey beard. Right. I like Stephen K. Amos if he was less famous. Bear Skriller still gets his hair cut with a hedge trimmer. You got crew, then bring them. I got bricks and I'm always on smoke. Fred Dibner. <laughs> I should leave you in my basement with the dead strippers, because I'll brush off one of those. <laughs> I should leave you in my basement with the dead strippers, because I'll brush off what little damage he manages. You're the old head that such an old head, the other old heads call him an old head. <laughs> Which is pretty much what this battle is. Ah. Me, I'm the catalyst, but your smooth jazz and boom bap, I don't understand it. He tries other genres. It's something tragic. I've heard this guy on fucking garage. Like the two-step verification. Couldn't hack it. <laughs> You're looking knackered, obsessed with doing boom bap, but every time the dude raps, he sounds like the brain gremlin from Gremlins 2, the new bat. <laughs> I'm everything the dude lacks. I would love to tell Boris Johnson to fuck off, but I will never get to do that. If you want to insult the Prime Minister, just tell him in the group chat. <laughs> <laughs> It's private school background, but it's not lies, it's true. I wrote the brain gremlin bar for lazy ass Jack. It still applies to you. We both hate Tories abusing their stature, but they're your fucking schoolmates. You tell the bastards. <laughs> fucking, I didn't pick my politics out of a book. I fucking grew up in a Welsh former mining town during the strikes when they were levered by Thatcher. Used to be a place to raise a family, now it's just unemployment and smack there. That's all true. My hometown used to be a needle pit. You won't believe the shit I saw too. Oh. Horror story, I had to leave to get cash, but he don't get that because he's real middle class. He thinks I live in some creepy wild shack with evil dead swag. Lad, I'll turn your gated community into a FEMA death camp. Oh. I went for a piss at with my old schoolmates. Set it right off. His school reunion? is on Epstein's flight log. We had to graft and we were never eating. You never had to graft because you went to eating. I've, I've, worked hard. I've worked hard and I'm all right now. I'm still dreading reading the winter bill for my central eating. I'll dead this heathen. He's into kids, blatant. But no one will say it in case they go online and get cancelled for kinch shaming. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking unironically, no hyperbole, anyone who went to a posh school is a paedophile. <laughs> <laughs> it's all <Again>. good. <laughs> <laughs> the 
Thumbs up, Sam. Say again. Oh no, right. There's no hyperbole. Anyone who went to a posh school is a pedophile. It's so Why did everyone shout? Pedophile. <laughs> 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 It's over, dickhead. Season final. You won't get out this jam with eating rifles. Mm. Ugly fat punching bag. Whoa, lucky slap would put him in check like a lumberjack. Mm. This country stands as humble brags. I'm that pub quiz junglist. I turn up with facts. <laughs> yeah, he'll have bars about drugs and that, but it's fake, bro. Because when you're dealing with the likes of me, you're the cunt who should just say no. But he's addicted to losing. Him and losses go together like plain clothes and Mondeos. <laughs> yeah, stay out of my business. I came here as a factor, you came here as a witness. You want to play the big man, save it for the bitches. I'm back causing trouble. Gabriel in Malignant. What, you haven't seen that film? You'd relate to that villain. Because you're all the shit, I bet your back's killing. I'm different, most blood in Madville, put you all into place. And by the way, you know you should probably call it a day when you have a panic attack when the flyer requires a photo that's not obscuring your face. <laughs> he was clicking the flyer on Facebook like, I'm in this picture and I don't like it. You ain't Dorian Gray. Because what little you you had is falling away and I'm only here to cause man stress. My achievements are achievements, not a poor man's flex. Gob off and I'll turn up to your door and then I'll turn your picture perfect family to a raw shag test. No. Yo, my shit is real, my shit is raw, my shit is. <laughs> my shit is real, my shit is raw, my shit is authentic. You can't spell you can't spell saxophonist, you put a sex offender in it. <laughs> So supposedly I'm some old head, old head. This doesn't matter if you look 74 and your fucking soul's dead. <laughs> <laughs> Let's begin this. I mean, you're not a rapper, bro. Just one of them slightly less than average Joes. One of them, look at them like rapping over there. I could do all that. Let me have a go. No! <laughs> <laughs> Sad. Look at him. Gum shield. Couple gloves attached. Doesn't understand he's just a fucking punching bag. Mm. <laughs> this is different levels. I got fist wounds from pit duels with devils. You, sickly and feral. <laughs> You're a lily petal with a sprig of fennel. <laughs> Tell this bitch to shettle, settle before I put Canel in his kennel. Because he can't stand in his shoes. I'm embarrassed to rap with you. Your fucking swagger says, had standard issue, hang tissue. <laughs> if my granny said to slap him, his pets would trickle. I wouldn't even use my hands, I'd just backhand kick you. Because <laughs> <fucking, laughs> now your head's in a rope. Well, I'm not even a rapper, I'm just a regular bloke. <laughs> Go ahead, say I'm middle class because my behaviour ain't black. Do your typical mayonnaise attacks. Because you're not. Say <laughs> hey, again. Trevor McDonald's, that's just crack, because yeah, all black people will just look black. Great. <laughs> Do your typical mayonnaise attacks, because this flow COVID free, you can smell I'm bringing flavour back. <laughs> Listen, these punches will hit him like I'm more than one person. One uppercut stun him, have his tongue turn in. By the time I'm finished with this smoke, You'll need a lung surgeon, because I'm spinning his winning record. Call this the dub version. Ooh. Fucking hell, let's go. Because your bar's soft. Feels like I'm having to battle the inflatable man at the car wash. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Carl lost. Carl lost to me. Fucking looking like you're stepping a car lot to me. You can't box with me. Carl lost to me, that's a shit bag, you know. A car lost to me. <laughs> Listen, you said Shuffle T's face looks divorced. <laughs> Have you looked at yours? <laughs> <laughs> Half 
sorry, half startled face like you stormed in and saw him wanking into a jar of grapes. <laughs> His aura says, harsh, disgusting. His aura says hardship and pain mixed with the charisma of a carpet stain. So Earth <laughs> keeps getting me back to wash these marks away. Mm. Are you all right? Are you cool? You looked tired and confused. It's like your soul died in the womb. It's like you had a midlife crisis in primary school. <laughs> This was the online champ. Really, kid? Can't believe in this shit. It's like 80% of his week consists of rummaging through ashtrays for the ends of other people's spliffs. <laughs> but I don't know if anyone see Apex 3. Yeah, yeah shit yeah. was really sick. There was this heat with Tally and Shotty, with Beats was ill and was really sick, and he just got jealous of the heat, so decided to make a racist meme of it. Oh. No one fucking asked. He just gets all gollywoggy in that. I'm looking at my phone like, fucking hell. Twitter's like, fucking hell. <laughs> but yo, that's real, that's real. That's real talk. I'm saying, he just saw the whole scene was pissed. So he saw his own racism and then he deleted it. But luckily, I kept a receipt of it. <laughs> so I'm fucking old this shit. This is a disclaimer, not associating him with this stupid racist shit, just him. I mean, lately he's been saying sorry lots. You know, like that time he, oops, accidentally posted a fucking golly walk. Remember that? <laughs> oops! It reminds me of that time when I um, came to Bristol, I accidentally got a gun and shut your bollocks up! <laughs> fucking <idiot. laughs> Oh, what? <laughs> so it's an accident. You didn't know it would happen. You knowingly associated two leagues with blackface to get no reaction. <laughs> fucking idiot. I mean, you're fucking dim. I should uppercut his chin. It's like, oh, it's such a funny thing. There's a black clown, a white clown. I wonder which color clowns will win. <laughs> Yo, Bristol, guess what's on the cards today? Who wants to see him spark a racist conversation and get sparked in his face? Because you are a disgrace. Oh, look at me, I've got a swastika tattooed on my ass and my face. <laughs> no, 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 just to start a debate. <laughs> I'm kicking his freaking door open, dragging him with electrical cords by his jaw till his fucking jaw's broken, like, hmm, that's thought provoking. <laughs> you ain't trying to start a conversation about racism, please. Why not just take a knee? No, we saw Apex 3 and his brain went bacony. I mean, <laughs> fucking saw Apex 3. He got jealous in his designs. It's all his insel energy and the jealousy inside. He saw other people and tried to denigrate their shine, but did he use the weapon to try denigrate the shine? I mean, listen, you are Earth's most grey guy. <laughs> Your only acclaim in life was putting two clowns online and getting face pied. You should be ashamed. Hide. Carve loser and troll on your face with a serrated steak knife. Because you can see it's not an ally, it's just a lie. You know? Oh. Yo! Oh. You're no fucking ally. You're a lie. That fraud and the fake type. You're an insubordinate snake. I should staple this to your forehead and break the floor with your face. Because yeah. you know what? It's a simple test, bro. When you're thinking of your next edgy post just to generate smoke, you're not a battle rapper, you're an internet troll. Yeah. I don't want to hear no more of this idiot talk. Just, mm, then he hits the floor. No more leagues. No more leagues should let him in the door when his banter's all Yorkshire cricket board. I mean... <laughs> just a bit of banter, just a bit of banter. You rap sloppily. Stagger like you're having a coronary. Because you're not a rapper, obviously. I mean, his lack of success in amateur comedy meant he had to manufacture controversy. 
And mm -hmm. that's just embarrassing, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> it's not hip hop. You tripped up, fucked up online, got rinse washed, and tried to come back different like a pink sock. <laughs> 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 Cause you're wisp framed, insane. The square triangle in this round, but didn't figure the card was Squid Game. Yeah. You're getting shit mixed and your limbs maimed. Cause he jumped on the wrong platform and didn't know the bridge would give way. I mean, the next time you're starting a conversation about racism and get barred from every league, it's not a conversation starter, it's just a desperate beggy scheme. You're in irrelevancy. Just one pebble in the sea. But genuinely, you've never offended me because you can't cancel something that doesn't exist as an entity. Well, this should be interesting. You miss out a lot of context, but it's okay. It's just a oh fuck it. This isn't going well. It's not going well, well, mate. No, no. It is not going well. well. But yeah, you say people shouldn't call you middle class. Why? Because you are middle class. You fucking this isn't going well at all. It's yeah. proper whack. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. It's How like you stop going? the crap. It's like you don't shoot guns and that, so you're not proper black. Mm. The fuck would you know? I'll treat him like Robinson Crusoe, I'll fucking strand him and beat his old crew low. Yeah. Yo, stop. yeah, fucking Robinson Crusoe, what the fuck is that shit? Fucking, if you fell off a uh, fucking ship, you couldn't even swim. Uh, uh, couldn't even swim. You can tell when no one believes in him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's such an ugly guy. So fucking poor and dry, he's literally a humble pie. Chuck <laughs> <laughs> it out. Oh, fuck it out. Have you mentioned the Trevor McDonald's because you were black? No, it's because you've got a grey beard. And the fact you brought right. that up was way weird, lad. Mm. Fucking, you said you've got fucking knuckle pie. You've got knuckle cuts from fighting. I've got knuckle cuts from fighting on the way here. <laughs> Woo! That's right. And Santa Claus also happens to be a black guy. <laughs> <laughs> away from my Jap side. <laughs> no, go ahead. Oh, that's mad, right? Flipping, he calls people out for racism and then says, J.I. <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to do it, man. Fuck, it can't get any worse. But there was some context, miss. I'm going to leave it at this verse. Yeah, he's using his brain foolishly. But I'm looking at Danny Jack like, true, why didn't he pick on the Chinese gay community? <laughs> just joking, just joking. Maybe it's a bridge too far. But I'm gonna fucking kill him and make his limbs pull apart. Uh, limbs pull apart, like I'm actually a holistic practitioner of Chinese medicine. <laughs> what? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Let's go. Would you like to buy some ivermectin? Again? <laughs> <laughs> yo, 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 yo. Me and, me and Joe Rogan are boys, in fact. I fucking, I'll fucking knock him out like Dr. Fauci with poison jab. Ooh. Poison not... jab. All this noise is crap. You and all your boys are whack. I mean, how do you think you got delivery and soil? I mean, you look like the poster boy for cod liver oil. <laughs> how are you going to speak with me? You need to just uh, freeze more beans and eat Omega-3. <laughs> Omega-3? I reckon I could take four. Chuck it out! Fucking you know damn well this isn't what you came for. No, it ain't. Your brain's poor. <laughs> Let me tell you, you're fucking whack. And you look like Earth's most middle class lumberjack. Why <laughs> <laughs> you tell me about how I'm speaking when you're the one who looks like you went to Eton? <laughs> Fucking, do I look like I've been eating? <laughs> do I look like I've been eating? No, he looks like he's been in the bin eating. You're a rather thin heathen. Let's go! I am a thin heathen, but and you know this. 
Well, fucking hell, cheers for taking the piss out of the homeless. <laughs> <laughs> Now that's not necessarily vocally true. I'm not taking the piss out of them, I'm just taking the piss out of you. Yeah. Oh, so is that always true? <laughs> <laughs> I had a punchline for that, I forgot it. <laughs> Yo, I'll fucking hit you like Boris Johnson in the cage fight. And you're a bit of a nufter so you can take some gay rights. <laughs> hmm. I'm sure that was hot, was it? It's probably battle rap strangest way to come out of the closet. <laughs> <laughs> And fucking Daddy Jack's here. Fucking if anyone comes out in battle rap, they do it on Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> I've been more than patient, but I'm sick of his bullshit talking, so I'll monster all his creations. Mm -hmm. I don't even know what the fuck that t shirt means, but I used it to relate him. Uh, you're going to monster all my creations. <laughs> <laughs> what in God's name are you talking about? <laughs> You're gonna monster all my creator. Fucking are you calling Pokemon or calling me out? <laughs> <laughs> yes! Yes! Fucking out! Yes! Fucking out! Yes! Fucking out! His brains went on the weights bench. I'm just calling out that bullshit B movie t shirt that doesn't make sense. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it does make sense. <laughs> Mothra is the best kaiju. <laughs> Protects the earth, unlike what this guy do. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> everyone that backs him and this feminine guy. I mean, trust me, you look like that's some version of the fly. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm some, version, I'm some version of this fly, but I'm not some feminine guy, and you look like you're about 75. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Truly, vocally, he's approached me with these themes when he genuinely looks older than me. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. You're old enough to be my paedophile adoptive uncle. <laughs> and you seem to know a lot about molesting kids. Don't let me get... Yo, yo. <laughs> hey, scratch that one out. Yo, yo. <laughs> we're ending on that. Hey, he's saying all this like it seems true. And I'm his paedophile uncle. Get to the green room. <laughs> Could do anything for relevance. <laughs> like, oh, can you guess the tail of the elephant? <laughs> You're wet and shit. Keep uh, going. Yeah. Seriously, does anyone want to buy some ivermectin to get away from this? <laughs> some what? Uh, some ivermectin or some hydrochloxy hydro. I, I, I shouldn't have tried to freestyle a bar involving hydroxychloroquine. Uh, I can't like, talk properly. It's the like most a... boring thing. <laughs> Every time he talks, he just slurs and he wobbles his sort of chin. <laughs> it's like, is it an evening or a morning thing? I'm not even sure. Is it, is it internal drunken performance thing? You don't get away with doing that. They say eight mile. Hydroxychloroquine. Fucking gay fetish clubs. That's what you're in. You're in. Nah, that's what you drink, you know. You're in. Anyone must be tweaking and having hydroxychloroquine if you think you all win. You're just fucking boring. Hydroxychloroquine. Say hydroxychloroquine. No. <laughs> <laughs> Tight! Tight! <laughs>